Hey, welcome to the Pump Up the Pastor segment. I got my brother, Joel Veal, here. And I mean my brother. I mean, I'll tell you what, you have been just a special friend. Yeah. Uh, and I've just really enjoyed working with you. Uh, Joel's got into a workout program. Uh, he got in great shape. How much weight did you lose? Uh, got down to 220 from 255. Okay, so that's 35 pounds. And gained some muscle back since then. Okay, so, so overall you probably lost about 40, 45 pounds of fat, yeah. put on about 10 pounds of muscle. Right. Uh, if you can't tell, this, he's a big guy. He was a Marine. Uh, now, now he does uh, serves God, goes on evangelical trips, mm -hmm. and we actually uh, support Joe's ministry with U-Turn. And I love, I love keeping him in shape. We work out in the morning. Uh, he had a little fallback, though, on his fitness program. We all do. Uh, we get busy. And what happened? You got busy with your, with your life. Yeah. You stopped eating Just good. The routine of life, and I, I stopped eating right. I stopped exercising. I got up to about 255 pounds and felt like I was just something was off. I went to the doctor and was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. Um, instantly prescribed medicines. I just didn't have a piece about that. Not that anything's wrong with medicine, but I just felt like uh, one of the first things she said is you can control this with diet and exercise. Well, I had been working with you for years and knew the value, yeah. knew the benefits of that. So I, I got back into it, and that's what I've seen happen since December. It's been uh, almost six months now, set going on seven months, and I feel great. Uh, changed my nutrition according to your standards, exercise, and supplements, uh, including a soluble fiber. And I've just seen incredible results. Uh, my blood sugars are normal, uh, as if I'm not even diabetic. So whether the Lord has chosen to heal me or he's choosing these yeah. methods to do it, um, things are So you are went back to, to the doc and she said, hey. All the blood sugar, all the numbers are normal. She was amazed. Told me I should okay. start telling people what I did. <laughs> okay, exercise, good nutrition. Absolutely. Okay, hey, one other thing I noticed, during that time too, you were here hitting the cardio. Yeah. Okay, you're on the elliptical every day. I get here and I get here early. You'd be here before me on the elliptical for 45 minutes. And that came into play in your last mission trip in that you were behind uh, your group uh, because God had something in store for you. And then you had to run for a whole hour. Mm. A whole hour, okay. He had to run to catch his bus. You think you would have been able to do it if you weren't in shape? No way. Okay, no so way. hey, we, we never know what's ahead of us. So life always has some surprises. So stay in shape. Don't abandon your fitness program. What we're going to do today on the Pump Up the Pastor segment or Pummel the Pastor, which today <laughs> it's going to be more of a Pummel the Pastor, we're going to do a superset, okay? We're going to do a superset of pull downs with a low row, but the low row, <laughs> I got some super strength tubing, okay? But I think Joe will be okay with it. So we're going to do a set of this, 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 a set of this. Right. Okay, non-stop action. <laughs> we're going to start out on the first set of front pull downs, light. Okay, so I want 15 repetitions on the front pull down. You got that all right? Because you always want to get a warm up. And he's leaning back a little bit. That's okay. Notice he's not swinging. I hope you're counting, Joe, because I'm the world's worst counter. Eight. You know, as far as your counting goes, Nine. get used to counting. Count out loud. Ten. That way you know you're breathing. Because if you Eleven. hold your breath, you're in trouble. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fantastic. Go all the way up with that. And have a seat. I got a little bench back there. And I want you to put your feet up here. Okay? And we're going to grab this. Okay? And I'm going to come back here and just block you a little bit. And now you're going to pull. That's it. And give me fifteen. Three. Four, five. As you pull six, with the tubing, it seven, gets harder as you go back. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifty. Fantastic. Okay, catch your breath. Because if you go right away, you haven't recuperated, you're spent. Okay. Again, how much time you need to rest? In 30 seconds, you're about 50% recuperated. In a minute, 90%. In three minutes, 100. I'm giving him 30%, or rather 30 seconds. So he's not going to get much recuperation. And now we're going for a heavier set. So we're kicking the weight up because he's warmed up. Get that set. And how about 7 to 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Make it 10. 8, 9, 10. Good. And come on up with it. And we're going back into the roll 
with the tubing. Okay, and get your hands in there. And I'm going to block you here and pull. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Eleven, twelve. Eleven, twelve. Good. He got fifteen the first time. A little harder the second time because we're pre-exhausted. So we're getting fatigued. Again, I'm giving him 30 seconds on this next one. We got lots of options on this third set. We could stay with that heavy weight, okay, or we could go with some endurance. I'm going to drop the weight back down to where we started. We got 15 repetitions and go after that again. Okay, Joe? But again, it comes down to what your plan is. If you want to just get big muscles or if you want to get more endurance, I think right now endurance is probably a little bit better idea. Four, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Fantastic. I haven't killed you yet, so nah, we're here shape. we go. Just ten on this one. <laughs> All right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Fantastic. And just turn around this way and just look over there. That was a workout. Yeah. Okay, people always talk about, I don't have time to work out. How yeah. long did that take us? Long. Six minutes, seven minutes. Yeah. You know, so if you don't have a lot of time to work out, look at doing some, some blitz workout. And then after this, my recommendation would be if you're pushed on time, get your cardio. Because right now we've depleted some of the carbohydrate depots, so your body's ready to burn fat more readily, okay? Hey, if you want to follow this guy out on, as he treks around the world, okay, you can check him out. You got a, a website out yes, there? Yes, uh, joetveal.org, one word, J-O-E-T-V-E-A-L.org. Fantastic. Hey, he beat diabetes. Thank you, Lord. You can too, okay? If you're eating bad and you're not eating right or you're not, not, not working out, uh, try to change that. Talk to your medical doc about, about using that before you get on the medication. And again, not that medication's bad, but you know, see what you can do with your body because your body's got some great potential. You just have to give it the right stuff. Otherwise, your body's going to get into a state of dis-ease. You say dis-ease real quick. What you got, Joe? Disease. Disease. That's right. Hey, pump it up, pull down, little tubing, yeah. go get it. Praise Thanks, Lord. Joe. Hey, thank you, Tom.